Now they label me a troublemaker. Who can you blame? Smoking weed help me take away the pain. Yo, what's up? Big, big facts in the building. Yo, man, I just saw this news alert right here. Guy right here, Poke Pookie Loke's son says he's getting death threats on social media following GZ versus Gucci Man. So, I ain't even know Pookie Loke had a son. So, this dude look like he probably about 19, 20 years old. And uh, he said he getting death threats. On Facebook probably on Instagram too so these despite the reheated and squashed beef all in one sitting taken to his social media the self-proclaimed son of Pookie Lok, the one that Gucci man killed Gucci man killed his dad expressed his displeasure with both Jeezy and Gucci the camps the CTE camp and the 1017 camp while re revealing his overall safety has been compromised huh is it that serious why they want to kill you though when your daddy already dead that don't make sense why are you getting threatened you know what I'm saying the enemy has been taken out so why is the son being threatened? It don't make no sense to me, man. So, little man says, I'm getting death threats and all. Let's do it. Get me a new strap. And he pointed somebody out. And I ain't gonna, I'm not going to put them on here. But uh, he put them on blast. He got their whole username and everything. He pointed them out, but uh, they not even worth putting up. They need to leave that boy alone. His dad already dad dead. What y'all messing with him for? During the height of Thursday night's tension, Gucci Mane brazenly performed his 2012 this song "The Truth," where he relives the May 10th, 2005 day where he had to fend for his life. And so, Pookie Loke's son handled his Quint Left Side Ross. I guess that's his Instagram. Could be Facebook, could be Instagram. Either one. He says, boy, that nigga disrespectful as fuck. And Jeezy, boy, I'm upset with you, cuz. So, he big mad. You know, I, you know, you can't please everybody. I'm gonna just say it like that. I heard G, I heard Gucci got people on his, on his team mad at him for doing the verses. You know what I'm saying? So. You can't please everybody, man. You just got to do you. Do what's best for you and your peace of mind. Minus the bullshit. Life's great. Just like Jesus said. You know, you got to minus the bullshit out your life. But that's it, man. Uh, yeah, y'all need to leave this boy alone. You know, his dad did. And he had to relive, he had to relive that moment again during this verses, specifically what Gucci said. It was very dis disrespectful, but uh, I'm not going to sit up here and judge Gucci for saying what he said. Gucci defended his life. He had a right to self-defense, you know, so... But uh, Gucci is really uh, savored savor that moment of his self-defense. 
you know, almost, I mean, pretty much enjoying how he defended himself, like bragging about it. And I guess, you know, that would hurt the man's son. You know, he just rehashing old wounds. But hey, man, it's a, it's, it's a crazy world out here. I'm out of here, though. Big, big facts. I gotta go.